So this happened last week. A million subscribers has been a goal of mine for years now, and it still feels surreal every time I open up YouTube and see that little M beside my name. So first and foremost, I just wanted to thank each and every one of you for making this possible. Your support has kept me going through this, and I quite literally would not have a million subscribers without all of you. I've never tried to make my content too clickbaity, and I really don't try too hard to play the algorithm. I've always just tried to tell important stories in beautiful ways, so I think it's a testament to all of you that I've been able to reach this level at all. So, I guess, give yourselves a pat on the back. And thank you so much. Really, I could keep thanking you guys all day, but there's some stuff that I wanted to let you all know about too, so let's get into that. First off, in order to celebrate this milestone, I'm going to do a little Q&A sometime in the coming weeks. I haven't done one of these in some time, and you guys always have interesting things to ask, so leave me a question in the comments, and I'll try to answer the questions that provoke the most interesting conversation. I'm not entirely sure when that Q&A will come out, but I might hold off until my play button arrives so that I can show that off for you. Beyond the Q&A, I want to give you guys a few reminders of everything that I've got going on, because I've been making a lot of stuff beyond what you see on this channel. I've recently finished up the first volume of my original series, Polyphonic Magazine, over on Nebula. That series is unlike anything that I've ever done before. It features intimate interviews with six smaller independent artists who I could never really cover on the main channel. Visually, the whole series is an homage to magazine layouts, with the videos themselves existing as living magazine spreads. Personally, I think it's a really, really cool project, and I would love it if you guys would check it out. And hey, thanks if you've already checked it out, and if you're already a subscriber to Nebula or Patreon, or if you donate me money on coffee or any of these things, just know that I really appreciate you. Right now, the first volume of Polyphonic Magazine has wrapped up. I'm going to take some time off, reach out to some more artists, and get some stuff together for a second volume, so it's a great time to check out the series and get caught up if you haven't gotten the chance yet. You can go to the link in the description to get a deal on that, by the way. I don't want this to be too advertising, but this is a project that I'm really proud of. So yeah, check it out if you want. Part of that series is also an accompanying email newsletter that I've been writing. Each newsletter contains a few thoughts on music history, culture, sometimes album reviews, always new playlists. It's essentially just a place for me to put thoughts out there that are too long for a tweet, but too short for a video, or sometimes even to gather my thoughts on something while I'm making a video. I, I, I think it's it's been a really fun experiment, and you can sign up to that for free in the description. Beyond my polyphonic work, I've also done some video work for a few musical artists in the last months, creating a couple of lyric videos. These videos have been really rewarding, and there's something that I'm keen to do more of in the future. I feel like I'm saying link in the description a lot, um, but I'll put the links to those videos there if you want to check them out. And if you want to understand the process behind making these videos, the last episode of Polyphonic Magazine was actually an interview with one of these artists who I made the video for, where we talked about the process of collaborating. And one more plug before I go. Did you know that I have a podcast? You might not have known because I never really mention it. I'm honestly not very good at self-promotion, but it exists. It's called Ghost Notes, and it features me and my fellow YouTuber, Twelve Tone, talking about all sorts of musical topics. It's good if you like musical conversation, and often it features both of us elaborating on thoughts that we encounter while making our videos, so it's a bit of a peek behind the curtain as to how our brains work, too. You can find that anywhere that you find podcasts, I guess. It's called Ghost Notes. Look, you know I'm not good at doing this off-script stuff, um, so... Yeah, I just thank you guys. I guess that's it. You guys you guys are awesome. I've I've got a million subscribers and you're if you're watching this, you're probably one of them. If you're watching this and you're not one of them and by some strange algorithmic thing you've come along and just watched this video, um you don't need to subscribe. I've I've hit the million, so it's it's cool now. It's good. But you know, if you like what I do, check it out. Okay, that's it for now. Uh, I'm going to go 
figure out my Q&A stuff, and I'll talk to you all soon. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for all of your support. It's It's been an honor making these videos for you, and uh, I've got some cool stuff coming up down the pipeline eventually, so I, I suppose I'll let you know when that comes out. I'm bad at ending these things. Bye.